step too far and spawn both of them. Or the second one. Now PB is Tibetan foothills. That was retarded. It's Tibetan foothills because I did a stupid thing. I tried killing the first snowmobile guy when I really shouldn't have been bothering. I was so set in my 100% uh, no damage strats that I just went for that one. Just because that was what I was used to uh -huh. and I didn't even occur to me that I could just run away from that guy. Especially because he doesn't even drop anything worthwhile. Or anything at all, rather. Rather. It was a mistake, and I can learn from it, so it's not the end of the world. Especially intense because I haven't practiced barking at all. Whoa, that is trippy. <laughs> Guess the ca I'm in a perfect position for the camera to be in the wall. Yeah, I go for the, um, uh -huh. I go for the key first. Keep jumping too way too late on that. Figure out the perfect spot to jump from so I land right in this corner. Uh -huh. Glitcher cheater reset bag lel kappa, I don't know. Why am I getting high CPU usage or high encoder? Ah, I need a new computer so bad. <laughs> Streaming at this potato quality, playing a game from 1997, and I'm using anywhere between 80 and 90 CPU. <sighs> that is the only way to do it, Action Turnip. Just waiting for them to swim away. That's And hoping they swim away. There's really no other way to do it. Other than just killing all of them. Like you just said. But. Nobody wants to save up that many harpoons. This one shark has eight harpoons. And then a fish is three. There's three fish, so that's nine plus sixteen. It's twenty-five harpoons you need right when you get to that part. No, oh, fish is four, isn't it? I can't remember. Plus, killing, killing them with the harpoons is risky because you actually have to be swimming around with them.
Yeah, I'm talking about Maria de Rio. Uh -huh. Yeah, the, the deck one is so easy. I just go... Uh, oh. <clears throat> well, the thing with the deck one is the sharks don't spawn until after you get the key. So I just go get the, the dragon the first time I go there. I kill the divers from the shore with the M16 and then I just go for the secret immediately and then go that way. Slow route, also known as the <laughs> correct route, Mr. No Loads, No Meds, without any of the secrets, Kappa. <laughs> I like my route just because that's the one I practice for no damage so I know when to expect every enemy and I know where I'm going exactly and it just it works out I that shimmy to this side and to be on the other side Is that actually at men's level? Oh, that weird lag. Holy shit. 100% CPU usage right now. What the hell is going on? Five, five frames per second. That's... What the fuck was that? Christ. What did I get for trying to stream on a computer for a laptop? A laptop and I'm... Never that I can't talk. <laughs> Why did you even get twenty five secrets? If your secret count isn't divisible by three, then you're doing something wrong. Because that means you got secrets. That means you picked up some secrets in a level, but not all of them, so you didn't even bother to go for all the ammo you got from it. But what the hell are you even doing, man? There we go. I'll have you know I'm not using a Pentium 4, I'm using a Core 2 Duo, Kappa. Uh-huh. No, what I do is I go to, uh, services, oops, go here, services.msc, well, you can't see what I'm typing, but you type services.msc in the start thingy, and you wait for the fucking thing to open, taking forever, taking forever. You get this window, and then you go down here to all the way down to the very bottom, and then you go to Windows Update, and then you go to Properties, and then you hit... Well, it's, it's already stopped for me, but then you just hit Stop, and then Apply, and OK, and then I never actually shut down my computer. I just hibernate, and then Windows Updates never comes on. I never have to worry about it. It's never a problem. Killing the service and task manager is like... I did that once, and it kind of like completely broke all my Windows updates. So that when I went to actually go update because I wanted to, it wouldn't ever check for updates. But I had to go through this whole huge process that involved Googling all kinds of random crap, and it was a nightmare. So instead of killing it in Task Manager, I just stop it. That way, the Windows knows to stop it correctly instead of just killing it on killing it unexpected unexpectedly. Yeah, I just had problems doing it that way, so I'm just 
Better safe than sorry. You can also go into Windows Update Settings and um, uh, select Check for Updates, but no, don't download and install and install them all the automatically. Just wait for your your approval to do it. No idea what you're talking about. I don't know what a PNP is. I'm just gonna pretend that it's I know what it means and agree. Yeah, that PNP is buggy. Yeah, totally. I hate that thing. Oh, plug and play. Yeah, you say USB devices. Now I realize what that is. Yeah, <laughs> I realized it right when you said that. I just didn't know what context that was trying to think in. I just saw PNP, didn't really know, but dude, you said USB. I was like, oh yeah, duh. bullet points. <laughs> I was installing Windows 98 in a virtual machine for something. I don't remember what it was. I think it was an old game. And, uh, no, a sim tower. That's what it was. And, uh, one of the bullet points when I was installing Windows 98 into it was, like, claiming how amazing it was, was, like, you can unplug and plug in your, your keyboard and mouse without having to restart your computer. Like, that was a feature. Repez, if you... You may be getting updates, but just Windows updating them silently. Because I think by default, Windows is set to just download and install updates just whenever it wants to. So you might just be getting them, and then it... It never even telling you, you're just, it's just updating in the background. Windows 7 will always Windows 7 will always be my favorite. This laptop's so old it came with Vista, I just realized that. Yeah, it could just be updating automatically. Knowing how Windows 10 is with the whole privacy shit. Probably not even telling you, and it's just doing it. Uh huh. Why don't you just turn off some of that startup crap? What I do is I uh -huh. like booted up my computer or whatever, and then just closed all the random shit that I don't want running, and like disabled Windows uh -huh. updates and all that crap, and killed off every process that I don't want. And then I just always hibernate my computer. I never actually shut it down. Most of what Service Host is is just for Windows update. Like when Windows up or when Service Host is running and it's using like 
a metric fuckload of CPU, it's usually Windows Update doing it. I highly, highly doubt it, Action Turnip. <laughs> I didn't want to use shotgun for that guy, but... I didn't want to run around in circles while I took out my pistols and did that uh -huh. shit. I do get a lot more shotgun shells later on, but... on this level. Because I like saving all my shotgun for, um, diving area. There's a lot of enemies at that level's a whole hell of a lot easier if, if I use shotgun for. Because they come in groups and shit. One more secret. I don't, why would I need to count pickups? I just want to make sure I have enough for the whole game. Because I know, like, when you get ammo comes in groups and stuff. And I still want to be... I don't want to run out of shotgun. When I'm going to need it. Yeah, why do I need to count pickups when I know... If I know where all of them are? Alright, one more guy left. My last attempt, I made it into the water. But he shot me when I was in the water. I need to get in the right spots. I don't like this position. Come on! Don't hit me, guy. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Okay, we got it. This should be Bartoli's. I like that positioning. That. Come on, prick. One more. One more. One more. There we go, there's Bartoli's. Yay! Fuck this level. Stupid easiness all the way through and then one fucking bullshit cocksucker right at the end. Anyways, let's not, like, fuck up over here or something and take random health. Time for Oprah's house, guys. <laughs> Ugh, this level's gonna be such a fucking pain in the ass. Then that level would be a whole hell of a lot more difficult. Save right. Beginning and...